first guest is a country music superstar whose new album, Body Language Deluxe, is out tomorrow. He's also a great coach on The Voice, which airs Mondays and Tuesdays at 8 p.m. on NBC. Please welcome the one and only Blake Shelton! Oh, Thank you for being here, and, and thank you for, for playing a game. Uh, because uh, I just we saw each other recently in person. Uh, you came, yeah. You, came, you helped me out on my show, That's My Jam. Uh, and and uh, you, we played some games, and I just know you had fun, right? Had... Oh, yeah, and now you're, now you're helping me out by having me play more of your games <laughs> uh, on the show. Thanks for the opportunities. <laughs> I uh, I, I, I will say uh, you were a good sport on the show, and uh, I, I appreciate you doing it. Although, I think you do have to brush up on your Taylor Swift songs. Uh, yeah. Yeah, because you, 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 <laughs> you didn't really know that. But I'm assuming you uh, must have run into each other in Nashville or something. Look, listen to me. There's, there was Taylor Swift. There's the country Taylor Swift, which I know some of that. I'm, yeah. I'm not as familiar with the, the new... Taylor Swift 2.0, which is, you know, the pop version, you know. I'm still I'm still stuck when she yeah, was you, doing her country records. You think you weren't? So mean, you, don't do, you don't do any country music on That's My Jam, by the way, because you had Ariana there, and so you were totally sucking up to Ariana and trying to throw, <laughs> throw music at her that you thought she would guess. That's not and true. And little did you know that Kelly Clarkson is such a nerd that she knows... Every song on the planet because she sings a different song on her show every day, so she knows every every right. word to every song. Yeah, but also I know by talking to you, you're you're like a musical encyclopedia. I could name a song and you could tell me who sings it. I, like, uh, who sings the uh, the Pina Colada song? Rupert Holmes. How the heck could you know that? That's well, I just happen to know that one. I just that was that was a lucky guess. <laughs> No, you're fantastic. So I figured. So when we were playing the game, I had you play, I had you uh, sing uh, the theme from the Golden Girls. I thought that was. That I did. Was... I did. I felt like I did a good job on that. By the way, you crushed it. I mean, it. I don't want to brag. I don't want to brag. Too but, late. Too you know. late. You too late. You already bragged. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I want to yeah. talk to you about uh, the, the new album. I want to talk about the Body Language Deluxe. Uh, but first, I want to talk about uh, your wedding. Look at this. Look at the beautiful couple right here. Look at that. Oh. My. Unbelievable. You know, beautiful. Gwen and I agreed that we like to take our publicity stunts all the way. <laughs> so we thought we would go ahead and just seal the deal. That's so uh, funny. You know, uh, it looked great. Uh, I, I just thought it was a beautiful everything I've seen in things. I mean, I didn't hear from you or anything, you know, personally, and say, hey, Jimmy, <laughs> what are you doing? Are you busy this week or whatever? I, you know what? No, no, look, not much planning went into it, I understand. No, who, who puts planning into a wedding, you know? <laughs> anyway, I, I just remember not being invited. And, uh, you know, and I go... We only had room for one NBC, one NBC host uh, at the wedding, so we had Carson. Yeah, you had Carson uh, Daly was there. That's true, yeah. But, um, you know, I've known you and Gwen for a long time, and I just figured, you know, I didn't figure anything, really, you know? Just, I was just sitting at home trying to, like, see, read on Twitter how, how's the wedding going. <laughs> anyway, it seemed like a blast. Uh, could, did, did you save me a piece of cake or anything? I mean, maybe that's you sent. Please don't send me that you banana. You always try to make me feel like Super Dave Osborne. Remember <laughs> Super Dave not, Osborne? I do not. I do not. You do absolutely. that every time. We no, talked about this last no, time. I and then don't. I end up coming across as the grumpy guy, trying to be festive, wearing a Santa hat. <laughs> And then you just kick me in the nuts over and over on national television. How could you be mad at? How could you be mad at, at, at this little guy? Look at this little guy. Ah. Uh, Look, that's you and that's Gwen. That's back when Gwen and I used to be brother and sister. <laughs> way, way back in the day. Uh, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, that was years ago. Unbelievable! Uh, uh, <laughs> but <laughs> when you when you did your uh, you, when you did your own <laughs> vows uh, for the wedding, uh, yeah. you surprised Gwen and you actually sang your vows. Is that correct? I did. Uh, well, Carson uh, told me that uh, he told both of us <laughs> that he expected us to write our vows uh, for the wedding, and which is a lot of pressure. 
uh, because, you know, as, as easy as it is for Gwen and I to get up and, and, and sing, uh, you know, to like write something down and say it is really awkward. And so I, I just copped out and went ahead and wrote something down that I could sing. Yeah. And so I, I wrote this song. I wrote it with a buddy named Craig Wiseman, actually. And it's on the this album that comes out. Uh, this comes out tomorrow, That's I think. That's correct. When does this air? It, does it, this air tonight? Are we you, live? You don't know when my show airs? Yeah, it's on is, every, the Tonight this, Show. At this point, your album is out. It's past midnight. You come on after... You after who do you come on after? <laughs> Anyway, I don't know if it's midnight or, or what. It what's is now going on midnight. Right? It's now midnight. It's past midnight, and this album is out. Uh, Body okay, Language Deluxe okay. is out right now. This is out. It's available, okay. and you can get the song. Okay. We can reach. We can reach the stars. It, That's the song. That's the song I wrote for Gwen Stefani. Wow. My wife. I love that. It's, now what? What? I hear, I hear the mixed reaction there in the studio audience. Like there was a few gas. Well, a little bummed out because we cheers. thought. You, which one did you write for me? Was it uh, Monday morning missing you? <laughs> or was it corn? No. Was it corn? No, but. Don't, don't you please don't bring up that. Oh my God! Please don't bring I'm that really up. I'm really inspired that. by this. <laughs> get rid of that stupid thing. Get, get rid of that dumb. I'm really thing. inspired by this. <laughs> I think we should write a song about it. Um, I want to talk about the voice when we come back. All right, more with Blake Shelton, everybody. When we come. Hey, hey, hey.